Hello everybody and welcome back to the Hacienda Rivet here. Today we're going to make something interesting from the Middle East. From Yemen actually. We're making Zhug. Now Zhug uh, originated in Yemen and uh, it is a very spicy and hot condiment. And uh, we'll describe the ingredients here. A little backstory here. How did I find out about Zhug? Well, many years ago, I had a boss who really liked cooking and uh, especially liked dips and condiments and stuff and gave me a bunch of recipes, which I've made. And they're delicious for whatever reason. This one, I forgot about. I tucked it in our cookbook and never made it. So I discovered it uh, a couple days ago. So today we're making Zhug. Uh, what we have here is one generous teaspoon of sea salt and black pepper generous teaspoon of ground cardamom. Now cardamom may be hard to find at your grocery store, uh, but you can get them in spice shops or specialty delis. Very, very unique spice, uh, very tasty. It has a slightly minty flavor, I think. Yes, yeah, very, very fresh, actually, uh, for a spice. And cardamom is known as the queen of spices. Yeah, so anyway, um, <clears throat> one teaspoon of ground coriander and one teaspoon of ground cumin. Uh, for this recipe we're going to need 14 serrano chilies. Now we're just going to snip the tails off and we're going to use them with the seeds and all. The juice of three lemons. Now we're going to use my latest uh, cheater's garlic that I discovered here recently. Uh, these come in a bag, these pouches, uh, at the grocery store and they're already peeled and they're just wonderful. So we're going to use one of those pouches. The recipe calls for 10 cloves. Uh, we're going to use two jalapenos one bunch of parsley and excuse me one bunch of parsley and one bunch of cilantro all right so it's very easy all we got to do is juice the lemons throw everything in the cuisinart and grind it up into a paste and then it's ready so let's go ahead and do that and join me when it's done okay so i had to make uh two batches in the cuisinart for all the ingredients then i combined them in the bowl uh, it smells pretty hot, but really nice. That fresh garlic in there is killer. So let's go ahead and try some on a chip. Um, this can be served over pita bread, dipped in there, or over roasted meats, grilled meats. Um, it's a hot condiment, so let's give it a try. Wow, that is good. That's an eye opener for sure. Ooh, it's got some heat to it, but I can see where it's going to complement um, spiced, roasted, and grilled meats. Definitely. Uh, you can taste the garlic in there, which is always fabulous. And the lemon juice really brightens it up. Mmm. Yeah, that is good. I like the blend of uh, cilantro and parsley. You don't get too much of either. Um, yeah, very well balanced. The um, spice powders, perfect. And the amount of salt in there was spot on. So, thanks for watching the uh, Zug, Zug, uh, the Yemeni condiment. Oh, and in the upper right hand corner, I'm going to put some hot black bean dip condiment that uh, my boss uh, gave me the recipe. It's delicious as well. Thanks for watching. Y'all take care.